At his sixth birthday party this year, Dylan Papier lit up his home with his usual joy and energy. Yeah! Daryl and Mark Papier, Dylan's mom and dad, experience his birthdays in a profoundly different way. They're haunted by the knowledge that Dylan is slipping away from them. He will lose his ability to walk, talk. Seizures, seizures. and cognitive um, issues, uh, almost like if you think of Alzheimer's. In fact, this little guy who lives and breathes baseball has what's been called childhood Alzheimer's and formerly Neiman Pick disease type C. It's a rare genetic illness afflicting only 500 people worldwide. There is no treatment. <laughs> like all kids with this disease, Dylan was born healthy, but then developed illnesses he couldn't shake. No explanation until at age three, the diagnosis. Shock, disbelief, and it was soul crushing. The Papiers were determined to fight back. They turned to researchers, including Mark Patterson, a prominent child neurologist. The dementia is not only something that happens to older people, it can happen at any age. And Neiman Pixie is a, a prime example of that. They're investigating why, in this disease that affects mostly children, fatty substances like cholesterol build up in the body's cells, destroying them and causing dementia. They hope their research leads to clues that will solve the mysteries of Alzheimer's with its similar symptoms. The, the scientific efforts are supported by a handful of families who raise awareness through heart-wrenching videos and fundraising at local sports events. Their crusade may be paying off. Dylan and others are now on an experimental drug that appears to be slowing the disease's Whoa. progress, and the Papiers refuse oh. to contemplate losing their little boy. If I thought about it constantly, it would be like a poison, and it would eat me up inside. We live in the present, and we celebrate every game and every um, birthday. They hope that in their contest against time... There has to be a first child to survive this. Why can't it be Dylan? There will be a scientific home run soon enough to save their son. Thalia Asuras, CBS News, Frederick, Maryland.